Today I want to talk to you about something that I haven't done before, and that's mythology regarding underwater life, creatures, gods, that sort of thing. We've all heard about the Loch Ness Monster or seen movies like Loch Man, but there's supposedly vast treasures hidden beneath the deep waters of the oceans. And what I have here is a demonstration to see if we can actually replicate one of these situations to where we can have their vast riches appear from out of nowhere. What we have here is we have an altar and then we have plaques of the protectors. And the protectors are a little bit interesting. That one being somewhat of a serpent. And that one being something I can't even describe that's mythological. And the third one with the triangular forces such as the Bermuda Triangle, whatever the case may be. We've heard of these sort of uh, situations before. We place the plaques on the stand. We have their altar here where their vast treasure lies invisibly. They want to protect their treasure. So we're going to take the plaques and one by one enclose the area to where their treasure lies. Now this is done very carefully by the gods. The gods are very protective of their treasure. Okay, so now what we're going to do without further ado is actually have their treasure appear. And what's that? That's in the form of a golden monolith with they're interesting looking gods like Loki or the other various gods on there for protection. And with that, it goes back to being simply an invisible altar. I hope you found it as interesting as I do. Stay safe. Thanks for watching.